Oh, that's a good fish. That's a real good fish. <laughs> G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Sammy Hitsky fishing adventure here on the beach. Brownies behind me rigging up. I've got a slug in my hand. Well, not that slug, this slug. I'm about to go for a quick spin. As always, chasing Trophy Taylor tonight. Um, it's about four o'clock in the afternoon, so I'm gonna have a bit of a spin, suss out a bit of water, and then soak some baits and see if we can't get that, uh, that big green back to come through and peel some drag. Anyway, while he's rigging up, I'm gonna go catch a few. Thanks for joining us. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Woo! <laughs> we go, well, a little bit of surf on today, guys. Gonna try and stand out in this back bank. On a fish in this little bit of foam out here. Looks unreal. I don't know how long we'll be able to fish here for. We're gonna get pushed off eventually though. It's alright. See how we go. Starting out with a 60 gram, 5 gram knot. Jig, well it's not a jig, spinner, but great searching lure. Nice bit of weight on it too. That foam looks delicious. Woo! Yes! There we go. There's a hit. See if we can't land one for a change. There he is. Oh! <laughs> spoke too soon. There was a tailor. It was the one we wanted. Got him. There we go. Seem to have a school moved in here now. Because we're out in this back bank, can't really wash them up. That last one looked like a fairly decent fish. Hey, he's not too bad. With a bit of luck. All right. It's two and two casts. <laughs> Success. Only a chopper to start off with. He wasn't as good as the last one that I dropped, but he's going to make some good baits tonight. Hopefully a few bigger boys are going to come through now. Yeah, it's a good start. Now obviously brain spiking this guy. Put him out of his misery, but I'm going to leave that blood in. Very nice looking water here. I'm not surprised that a few have moved through. I've just been casting that way, the foam's better over there. Brownie's out. Full strength attack now. Got him? Brownie's on. Always nice to get a few on the spin before the night session because night sessions can be bang or bust. We've seen it before. I'm sure we'll see it many more times. Yeah, nice one, Brownie. 
Why does no one else have a problem with them jumping off apart from me? There we go. <laughs> that one had a couple of whacks at it. A little bit of weight there. Might be touched fouled, is he? Oh, he's alright. Just a bit better fish, I think. Yeah, he's not too bad. There he is in the waves there. Finally, some decent. Oh! Only choppers at this stage, but they do love a 65 gram night jig in that afternoon light. Oh, magical. Like absolute candy to them. We've got uh, two for the uh, night's festivities. I think Brownie's going to keep a feed, so this guy might even come home for the table. Do you want this one for a feed, Brownie? Yeah? Yeah? Was well, it's one we don't have to catch later. Phantom tool. Hit that brain. Pop the gills in the back there. And give him a rinse. Now if you weren't staying for the afternoon session, there's dinner right there and three fish. How good is winter? Absolute best time of the year. Brownie's back into another one. Well, this is good fun. Oh, don't jinx it. <laughs> Definitely is nice looking water though, perfect. Big foamy gutter. They're nice choppers, they're not huge, but they're, they're in good nick. Just right in that back bank there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's a bit better. Yeah, he's a nice fish. Oh, he's sorry, getting too excited. He's not that nice. He might even earn his release, that guy. Little chopper. See you in a few years. Oh. oh, just as I stopped it in the back there. Double hookups on sunset. Could be worse. They're sitting right on that edge, eh? The boys are on. He can go. Certainly plenty of small chopper class fish here. Which I don't mind, because where there's action like that, there's bigger fish that are keen to take a bite out of them. <clears throat> one more, one more, no more. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Well, you're getting them in this foam here. Yeah, Ada, you want him?
Might be, might be time to go. You're gonna end up in there. You're gonna end up in there. Is it a good one at least? Oh yeah? I'm gonna hook one and then walk in and land it over there. Oh, that's a better one. And your lure. Oh. <clears throat> Alright. Last one. Well, that was a bloody good spin session. It is time to crack out a few baits. Wait for him to come into this gutter. It's, sh fingers crossed, should be a really nice afternoon session. Turning into a night session. There you go, guys. A few choppers in the esky there now. That small one, for reference, is 38, so the others will be in that 40 to 45 class. Um, a couple of better fish out there, kind of jump offs, but that's a great start for uh, pre dawn, or pre dusk, sorry. What do you reckon, mate? Get some baits out there and sniff out his bigger brothers. Well, we're just getting kind of set up. Rod's in the holder. Actually hadn't a beer. Thought there was a couple of hours left in this gutter before it kind of turned on, but nope. Line went slack, not tight. I went, hang on a minute, something's picked that up. That's a lovely little fish. That's um, probably mid 50s. Probably not, not super deep, but a nice long fish. Lovely way to start the night. Hopefully they get bigger and badder from here. Unfortunately guys, no more Taylor for the night. The gutter never really filled up like we thought it was going to. So, here's a few more fish from a couple of recent rock missions, including a cracker from the opening scene. Enjoy. That's a good fish. That's a real good fish. That's a real good fish.
And that's why he was going so hard. Absolutely raced away with it. I thought it was a big tailor for a bit there. Oh, then he went deep and didn't come back. Good start though. How good's rock fishing? Well, morning GT, that gets the heart rate up. Too good to catch one, so. See you, mate. Away he goes. Oh. Look. There we go, guys. The old 40 gram knot. If you can't catch them on a 40 gram knot, then there's something wrong. Straight out the front. And I've paused it. Straight out? Yeah. Just on that back line. Uh, it was inside that, but I... Oh, he's a good fish too. What? He's a good fish. Yeah, right. Do you need a hand? Um, no, but if you want to move, I'll swing him up that side. Oh, hang on. He's coming around. <laughs> Lovely. There we go. They're on. Well, just out past it. Which, which way is he going? Oh, there he is. Lovely. Nice, Luke. Pretty work. Watch this wave behind you, have a splash. Anything? Yeah, yeah, we'll have a feed. <laughs> Got him. He's not big. Oh, there we go. Oh. oh. What the? Another one ate it. Just, just there's just the whole school following him. Another nice one. 40 gram night jig, can't go past it. Brings all the boys to the yard. Nice chopper. Unfortunately guys, that's all we've got time for this week. Hope you enjoyed the Taylor trips and don't you worry, there's gonna be plenty more beach fishing action to come as the season progresses. Anyways guys, hope you're all catching a few fish. Stay safe and I'll catch you next week for another Sammy Hitsky fishing adventure. Cheers.